lower than your sister. It's lower than your mom. Hey man, episode 13, IJMKTV. Yes. In this episode, we're going over blood work. You'll see my testosterone levels. <laughs> Finally! Look at that. Got sponsored, so use my code, buy bucked up. Code, code in bio right there. Boom. Um, nope, shoes and socks off for some energy at his tools. Uh, I threw up. You threw up? Okay. That bottom of the feet should be fine. All right, you're done. You can step off. 14%. So somehow I gained fat. I somehow got fatter. It makes no sense to me because I really don't feel like I got big. <sighs> gained about six pounds. That's not bad. Though. I'm not mad about that. But six pounds of what? Six pounds of fat? Well, it, pretty much that's where it's going to have you. No! Six pounds of fat. That's a lot of fat. That's a lot of fat. What was I at? 12? I was at 10. Now I'm at 14.4. That's some shit. Whoever guessed 14% was right, so. I'm gonna go over my blood work because I have no clue what I'm looking at here. Okay. Triglycerides, that's your fats. Um, let's. Test levels are good. That's always nice. Hey. 700. Joshua total gets 21. Jesus. So he has a 21 nanogram per deciliter total test, which is lower than your sister. It's lower than your mom. What's the, what's the normal range? Their normal optimal level is 700 at least. Absolutely. That's a natural normal. test too. That's yeah. not even yeah. Absolutely. Hey. <laughs> That's above edge, right? I think that's good. Um yeah, you're on the higher side of, of hey. the good range. Yeah. Blood sugar level is good on the lower side, that's good to see. Yeah. If you actually want to like attack some fat and everything, yeah. I would have you probably call it like a carb cycle, for okay. example. Um where you're gonna manipulate that and how would I do that? How would body. I do that? No more carbs, just do straight meat and veggies. Uh then tomorrow, no carbs, straight meat, veggies, and then same with Sunday, do a little bit for your first meal, and okay. then no carbs, and then go back to like Monday to start eating regular again. Shit, I don't even eat that much. So how many calories do you think I should eat? If you're trying to cut, probably like 2,000, 2,500 calories. 2,000? 99, 99, sad to say, 93, sweet honey. So I tried the carb cycle. I would not recommend it. Himalayan pink salt, yes sir. This has no carbs, of course. It really didn't do much. I didn't drop the weight when I needed to drop the weight. Maybe it's just because I didn't do it hard enough. Maybe because of whatever. I don't really know, but like I did do the carb cycle. And of course, Chris Bum's secret sauce. Turkey and spinach mix for four days, no carb. It's got two percent carb. Oh, and of course, the protein shake. Tomorrow's the big day. The world might end if I don't walk in ketchup. Um, I miss carbs. This is mentally exhausting. You're tired. You're, I don't know if this shit works or not. I did it hard enough for it to lose weight like that, but I feel weak. I'm slow in the head. You don't feel 100%. You don't know what you're thinking about. Like, it's just junk. It's honestly junk. I'm trying to get something hella hard. I don't know how y'all do this, this is crazy. He might mentally be like, oh my god, what am I doing? And so like, I understand why people do it crazy and they're doing performing on stage. I would not recommend it unless you're prepping or some crap like that. It mentally messes you up really bad. And that's what I can't have. I suffer from depression already. When I get messed up in the head, I get insecure really bad. I get anxiety really bad. So like, I would honestly recommend fasting over carb cycling. Cause like I hated carb cycling. Carb cycling is supposed to help your muscles and all this. I didn't really see it. I'm honestly more ripped than I was off when I was on the carb cycle. So I don't really know if it was like, I regret not going with what I know. I know what my body's capable of. I've done this for years. And I listened to some dude that thought they knew my body and knew what I could do. And that was my fault. I wanted to try it. So I tried it. Your body might handle it different than mine, but mine did not like how it was. Yeah, I felt bloated at the end of it. I felt like I gained the weight faster. And so it was just like, bro, what am I doing? Why do I do this? Just put myself through absolute hell. So, but also if you go on my Instagram, bunch of new, not a bunch, but I got some recipes, some smoothies, some, you me, some protein shakes. I want to give you guys a little update and some of the reasons, like the reason why I didn't really post in March. March is really hard for me because two years ago I got stabbed and two years before that I lost someone. 
that was really, really close to me. Cling and jerk? Huh? Cling and jerk? I wish. <laughs> I know that. 